And I think about the babies that are in this lockdown. Mm. That hurts me. That hurts me. It hurts me. Tonight, very emotional parents worried about losing their neighborhood school. Now, Lincoln Heights Elementary is already on lockdown, and the Princeton District is now considering a more drastic move. WLWT News 5's Jackie Congedo spoke with both sides about the new safety concerns and what could happen next. Well, what are we saying to the gang bangers? What are we saying to the dope boys? If you go and keep shutting down everything that's pertaining to our kids, you are, get, you are saying to, to those violent minded folk, you win, take over. The motion and anger met by applause in a standing room only meeting to address what school officials have called significant safety concerns at Lincoln Heights Elementary. I have a great grandbaby down, goes to that school. You hear me? And I'm not afraid for him. We'll come up there. If you want us to come up there, hey, we'll march around the building. Right. We'll make sure it's all right. The school is on lockdown for the remaining few days of this school year. No outdoor recess and extra police. Kids live what they learn, and children in Lincoln Heights hear a lot. And they know that the word lockdown means penitentiary. Lockdown aside, many fear the district will bus kids out of the neighborhood, essentially shutting down the school. It's not the intent to close the school, but we have concerns. The district superintendent listed 23 of them in the last 11 months. Incidents ranging from broken windows to shootings with a school bus caught in the crossfire. I think there's a lot of work to be done between the 19th of May and the 19th of August. So for now, the lockdown will stay throughout the end of the school year. Could Lincoln Heights Elementary close its doors at the beginning of next year? The superintendent said today he simply could not say at this time. Reporting live outside Princeton City Schools tonight, Jackie Congedo, WLWT News 5. And Jackie, district officials saying that 40% of kids who could attend Lincoln Heights Elementary request to go to school elsewhere.